Yo guys, welcome back to another Lockcraft episode, and today we are going to do a lot of cool stuff. But before we do that, um, I am recording on my new PC now. As you can see, that's why I have a lot of FPS. I'm not going to go deeply into that because I'm going to make a separate video on that, so make sure to stay tuned for that. I just want to say that because maybe the quality may not be as good. You might be asking, what? why did you buy a new PC if the quality is going to be worse? Well, I'm still figuring out all the settings and stuff that can take a while, but... Make sure to give your feedback in the comments if you're ex experiencing something different that you don't like. And yeah, also my mom started cleaning the house. It always happens when I start recording, of course. My life can be better. Okay, so I hope you don't really hear it because that would be quite annoying. So anyway, I'm going to show some things that have changed since the last episode. First of all, we got a fish. And second of all, I finished the 10 layers of black glass. That took a little while, but it's finished now and I think it looks pretty cool. Um, if you didn't know, I made like almost six layers yesterday i just didn't have enough glass for the six layer but now 10 layers and it looks really cool um the only thing i really want to do here is just place some vines on the side and then yeah i think it will be finished and then today we'll be a lot we'll be doing a lot of stuff uh, around the base here okay someone put signs here hey i heard you need some black dye lucky for you a new shop has just opened selling rear roses please buy some <laughs> unfortunately for you I already got all my black dye, but <laughs> if I need something uh, to do with black dye in the future, I will definitely come to your shop. Also, I got like no time to make this video compared to yours. And I also promised you guys to make longer videos, so this is going to be interesting. So we're going to do a speedrun today of making this video. Speedruns are quite popular lately, so I don't think that's going to be a problem. And that's also the reason why I'm making a long intro like this. So in this video, we are going to get rid of this cobblestone box. It's really ugly. And yeah, this is of course the villager trading hall <laughs> with only four villagers. And we are going to put this in the base where the zombie is right now. Die. Die. Yes. Um, so we are going to put them in here and probably get a lot more villagers because forge of villagers is just pathetic. And we're going to need a lot of spruce wood for that. I already made a design for this in my single player world. And yeah, we're going to need a lot of spruce. So that's why I uh, got some spruce logs here. <laughs> the spruce forest now has a big bald spot on it. Yes, there we go. Maybe that's why the server is called Logcraft, you know. So we got some crafting table going because that's how English works. And I think we are going to make the entrance of this something like this. Uh, with some spruce logs on the sides. And then some trapdoors here. And yeah, that looks, that's like nothing special, but... I think we're going to go with that, maybe I'll change it in the future. Okay, we're like one minute in and I already used more than... <laughs> I already used more than a stack from the four stacks that I grounded for this uh, thing, but... Anyway, this is kind of like the shape where we're going to go with. And you may be thinking, yeah, this looks terrible. And I know this looks terrible, but there is no detail in here yet. So we are going to go with something like this, so... I don't know what it's called, okay, but <laughs> this looks cool and... Some stairs here. And then something like this. So as you can see, this looks pretty cool. I saw this in a build yesterday and I really liked it. So I'm just copying it, yeah. Um, but this looks already a lot better. And in here, and like in these openings here, we're going to go to villagers. And I think that will look really cool. And some more progress, as you can see, I think I finished all of the wood stuff. Um, now there is a lot of stone here. I'm of course going to make it less flat by adding some andesite and some bricks in here. Um, I also set up my beacon uh, to mine a lot of blocks here. It's, uh, so yeah, it's, uh, it's over there. But um, I think you know where the villagers are going to go. And of course, we're going to make it look like a prison because villagers don't deserve rights. And it's going to be looking something like this. Oh, maybe actually... Okay, no, it's going to look like this. So, yeah, I, I really like the chains for some reason. And um, now, this, if this is open, I can access all the villagers here. And then there are going to go the workstation. So I can put, like, uh, four workstations here and then four villagers. So if I want four librarians, I can put, it, I can put them in here. And the same goes with, like, farmers there and whatever I really want. Okay, this already looks a million times better with all the uh, details in here, all the different blocks. It really looks <laughs> like a prison if I add all these iron bars and stuff. So I think it's almost time to put the villagers in here. As you can see, no villagers in here and we can finally remove this box. I'll quickly show you where they are. Uh, if you go in here, as you can see, 
they're all locked in place um, and <laughs> yeah this one is stuck I think and it, I think this looks really cool <laughs> it's like a prison full of villagers I'm going to add some more of course because four is not too much and yeah I'm now going to remove that, that ugly box finally you may think like yeah this box is ugly but so are all these other farms well um, I'm, if I remove this I will probably make like something around all of these uh, like a tower around that one the iron farm and then some houses around these farms and there are going to be more farms so we get something like a village and i think that will look kind of cool so i i am not sure yet if i'm going to do that but i think that's about like the best thing i can do to decorate this place so as you can see i removed cobblestone box so now that's out of the way and we are going to start with a new project which is a mob farm uh, because i really want to make my own rockets and yeah Mob farms give gunpowder. I'm also going to need a sugarcane farm. So, but that's going to be for later or maybe next episode, I don't know. And we need a lot of cobblestone, but I do not think that is going to be a problem. Uh, because we have a couple in these chests, as you can see. So we are going to build it somewhere on the sea. But probably not here, because I really like this place and it's close to my base there. So we're pro probably going to make it somewhere out of here. And oh yeah, here here I get all my sand. So we're probably going to do it somewhere here because this already doesn't look too good anymore. Um, so I think this is a good place to do it. Yeah, this looks like a good place. It's also it's also enough space and stuff. Yeah, I'm going to make it here. So this is the place where we're going to build it somewhere in the middle of the ocean. And I'm going to start placing in the hoppers, and then later we will start with the time lapse. So this is going to be our temporary solution for the storage system. We're going to make a bigger one like a sorter so all the mob drops get in their own chests. But this is good for now, like one double chest or a little bit more. Okay, so there we go. Let's start a time lapse now. So the mob farm is finally done and yeah I made a little AFK spot here, this wasn't in the time lapse but let's go down and let's see how it's working. So as you can see a lot of mobs here and I think they just got flushed down so we should see them falling. Oh uh, whoa yeah there we go. All of the mobs are coming down. and. We should be seeing a lot of stuff in here already and I, I didn't even really AFK here, not even like, maybe like a minute uh, trying to start this recording but this is a lot of this is a lot of stuff for just like standing there for like a minute so this is going to be really useful. I um, made this farm mainly for the gunpowders for the rockets um, but the other stuff is going to be useful too. But yeah, for rockets you also need paper and for paper you need sugarcane. So I am going to make a little sugarcane farm just to AFK a little bit. And then next episode we might get like a bigger one. Um, but just, just a little temporary one for now because yeah, this is my farm now. Just some sugarcane next to the water. I really want to, <laughs> I really need a little upgrade. So for the sugarcane farm we are going to go with one of the most basic out of the, all the basic designs out there. Um, it's just going to be like 10 sugarcane next to each other and 
with some observers detecting if it grows and then piston breaking it and yeah it's a really simple design but so I can AFK it and uh, maybe next episode we'll make a bigger one or something that is actually enjoying to watch Ep next episode who knows an actual fun episode nah not on this <laughs> not on this channel okay okay we're replacing the sugar cane uh, like that last but not least all the observers like that and now I am covering everything up with some glass so we can actually see it uh, and like that this farm is already done um, I do need a hopper minecart in here so and yeah this is the most basic sugarcane farm ever um, we'll probably get another we'll probably get a better one in a later episode but this will be good to just get some rockets for now wow this place is getting really ugly I really need to do something about it but this is all I've got time for today I hope you enjoyed and I know this is a short episode and I know I promised longer videos but that really wasn't possible with the time I had today. If I had enough time I would have done it okay, I promise but next time it will, next video will be a little bit longer I apologize but yeah I hope you still enjoy it. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!